welcome to Cliff Brodsky's next show. He's the author of I Found God in Hollywood, a singer, songwriter, piano player, and owner of Brodsky Entertainment and Rock Man Enough Music Publishing. He's a renaissance man who specializes in making documentary films, starring in his own reality TV shows, and likes to interview his guests about their lives, philosophies, meaningful stories, and how it all relates to our well-being. Topics discussed range from lifelong career goals, promotion of guest artwork, music, and websites. He loves to entertain and educate his audiences about important subjects that will improve society and humankind during these times of great transformation. Join Cliff today as he discusses our life's purpose and digs deep to uncover our true nature using honesty, humor, and spontaneity. Now kick back, get ready to be inspired, and laugh out loud. Welcome to Cliff Brodsky's next show. We need absolute silence, and now we can talk. Welcome to Cliff Brodsky's next show. Yes. Today on Cliff Brodsky's next show, we have Gary Smith. This is Gary Smith. How you doing? Hey, man. You know how you had to work that? Yeah, yeah. I think I watched it. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think I handed it to you. Put oh. it in your palm. Okay. And then strike it kind of gently. Mezzo forte. Oh, perfect. Okay, now try, to, try it again. Like, okay. really palm it and hit it, like, medium harder. No, no go, like, go like this. Oh. Watch. Like, like ding it. Here. Okay. Kids upstairs. But it's a cool thing, huh? Yeah, it's very cool. Yeah. All right, well, it's not about that. It's about, you know what it's about? It's about... It's This is about a reunion. I have not seen you in, what, five months? Four or five months? Has it really been that long? I don't know. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. Well, actually... It's been a couple months. No, because I started my new what position color in October. Hair, October. October Red. Oh, yeah. Auburn. October, November, December, January, February. Like five months. Where does the time go? You know, Stay it's with. just Monday, Zooms to Friday. I was in my 40s, weekend. now in my 50s. It's like a whole decade <laughs> went by. Crazy. Seriously, crazy. I turned 50 in October. You were at my birthday. I saw you at my birthday. Oh, yeah, I did make it to your birthday. That's right. Yeah. So then I've seen you since yeah. October. Oh, so I think yeah. I saw you in November. You probably. must have. Yeah, even maybe, uh, maybe even this year. Okay. No, no, I've seen you this year, so yeah. it hasn't been that long. You, probably been... you probably came by for some water, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> but here's the thing. So Cliff Gary... has this amazing... Oh, here's the thing. Water. It's not about the water. It's about Gary. You have a new movie, right? I do have a new movie. Well, I want to hear that. about the movie. What is it called? Um, that's a good question. <laughs> is, is there a name? It's in German. Can I, can uh, I, can I do a little intro to this? Yes, go for it. So, Gary, as you know, he resembles... That guy. That guy. That funny know? looking guy. He's better looking than yeah, that guy. he's way better looking. Way better looking. Oh, and, you, and he has a Facebook for... He does look like appearances because he looks like yeah. that guy. And he was discovered from these uh, producers and directors from Germany. They fell upon the site and they wanted a character Look like. that looked like the guy. And basically, they flew Gary out to Germany. He was what there is... for a couple months. And I saw the movie. It's good... It is a hit over in Germany. Really? Gary's yeah. a celebrity over in Germany. Really? And I have to say, I had never seen Gary's work before. Really? Gary... Is, killed it. Uh, he killed Acting. it. Was in German he killed or it. English? And and what's so what what makes me so upset is because he should be a star here in America. Well, who he cares? Really he's a star be. somewhere. He's a star yeah, in Germany. Exactly. And now David Hasselhoff is a star there. Exactly. And now they're doing a sequel to it. And Gary's been asked back, and in, in May they'll start filming, and so he'll be there yeah. for about three months. So, are you starring in it? Absolutely. So you're, yeah, you're a lead character. Oh, you're a movie star. Oh yeah. No. Now do you have to speak German or English? Uh, this one I'll speak a little German, but it's it's a sweet. Speaking to Deutsch. A little. Eine kleine. He's not just speaking to Deutsch. Yeah. We. Yeah. We. He's in trouble now. Yeah. 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 Herr Kommandant. Halt. Halt. Schnell. Schnell. Oh. Oh. And one more thing. What? So I met Gary actually on a modeling job years ago. Did we you? met in a jacuzzi. Wow. And yeah. I just want to add to this. You're not fat. We realized... I never said I was fat. I don't think you're fat. Oh, I can't. <laughs> what? <laughs> we met in a jacuzzi on this modeling job, and we realized in the jacuzzi we lived on the same street. Really? We were both born, like, weeks apart. She was a little younger than me at the time. Yeah. <laughs> That's changed. That's weird. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> so we find yeah, out yeah. we're both tourists. We live on the You're same street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And on that same day of that job, this is back when everyone had pagers. We were all, all the models that were pagers. waiting on a big job in Jamaica. And at the end of the day, Gary and I both were buzzed. We both booked Buzz? the job. Buzz on our Oh, like pagers. eating a time. So Jamaica Gary and I were off flip. to Jamaica. We've been friends ever since. So that that's the cool part of it. Was it? It's been a long time. It's been a long time. Yeah. Now, all you to remember, on Howard Stern Show, what does Robin do? Listens. She listens a lot and she laughs a lot at Howard. <laughs> <laughs> and every now and then he'll go, right, Robin? She'll go, right, Chief. And then that's a lot of that going on. Oh, my goodness. So I want you to lay back. and have, And then... I'm going to ask you some great questions, I promise. Absolutely. But I want to ask you. Okay. So where are you from, man? Uh, from Maryland. Are you from Maryland? Yep. Silver Maryland. Spring area? Right uh, right? Actually, right outside Silver Spring. Okay. From Maryland. I don't know that yeah. is. Yeah, I've been, I've been there. Yep. Went to College Park, University of Maryland. Park, where? Georgetown? Yeah, no, University of Maryland. University of Maryland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Georgetown's nearby. Oh, Across yeah. Across the river. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's... What did you... Did you always want to be an actor? Or uh, you know, no, I just kind of fell into it. I, once I graduated, I kind of... I what, to the West Coast. What did you um, want to be or do when you were growing up? You know, I wasn't really sure. Surf <laughs> a surfer. You're a surfer. Was, you know, to play with the business and just, you know, have but fun. I saw you enjoy with life, have fun. But I've seen you with surfboards. Yeah. You surf. Yeah, yeah. Just a little bit. <laughs> what? Yeah, come on. A little bit? What? I'm, I'm here to listen. Anything for a picture. I'm here to Wait, so it's more of an, a look. You don't, you're not a surfer surfer. You like the Beach Boys. You surf, yeah, yeah, I love the Beach Boys. But, you can, but you, can, you can get on the surfboard. <laughs> Absolutely. So you have surfed before. <laughs> yes, yes. But I you're have. not a surfer. Well, it's, it's relative. Okay, well, <laughs> all right. Let's, yeah. start, let's start with what you are. So what are you? Um, what are you good at? Um, um, <laughs> what? Oh, I, I do. Uh, I also, I'm I also, always supposed to listen. I also do interior design. What's wrong with that? That's a. I need help with my interior design. He's great, really yeah. great. That's a great, yeah. usable. That's a, that's a skill that people need. That's like a thing that people need. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. yeah. I want to build a house, and I want Let's to design it. it. Let's do it. And have like my friends help me like pick the right things and figure make it all perfect. That's Absolutely. your man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Do you have any particular style or flavor you know, of your I, school? I, I, but more traditional, but very minimalist. I don't know. Very minimalism, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's very clean. What do you think? Remember that uh, John Lennon movie? Imagine with all white. It was all white and he had no furniture. It was just a white piano and they sat on the floor. That was oh, it. That's, mm, okay. that's too minimalist. That's, that's <laughs> it was really minimal. Yeah. This movie, did you get they pay you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. The first one was actually, first one was a low budget, but, yeah. but it was. Pretty pretty, pretty good compared to yeah. LA standards, yeah. and um, the next one is even bigger. It's even for, better. It's for the. Cinema. Do you have an agent or you have to cut your own deal? You know, first one I cut my own deal. Next one I'm actually have a, a meeting on Friday with an agent. Uh, so you haven't made the second one yet? No, no, we uh, we it, fly out on the seventeenth. But you signed the contract. There you uh, contract is about a month away, but we've gotten we've had to do paperwork and commit to it. But they're not going to can you if you get charged too much. Uh, you know, I, no, no, Make no, sure no, you I, don't charge too much. Make sure you just, just get the gig. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Deal. No, I, 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 I don't think anybody you know, can take my place. The first movie revolved the, around me. They'll find yeah. someone. Tr trust me, man. There's yeah. other guys you can find. Don't lose this job. That's a good point. That's a very you good really point. You really want to work yeah, 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 because yeah. you could you, building on it. So now you have two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now it's like, oh, he did this. And they asked him back. Great. Yeah. It's like good to do work. Yeah. Hard well, to at, work. At the end of the movie, I... I go on a world trip with my girlfriend so they didn't kill me off so there could be a you a, know, a third perhaps a threequel yeah a threequel a threesome <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah yeah threequel yeah. so how's your new job it's great yeah. I like it I'm happy it's it's great and I'm you selling stuff insurance or t what are you doing um, basically, when a seller goes to sell their home, they have to order a natural hazard disclosure report. My a company, natural hazard, hazard disclosure, disclosure report. report. You have to report if it's in earthquake zone, fire zone, flood zone. Right. Yeah. You all have to do that. You, you have to order one. And yeah, you yeah, may yeah. not know who you ordered it from. Hopefully, you ordered from my company, Property ID. Huh. But, no, um, no. but the cool thing is... About once to twice a month, I've still been doing my other career, and I've been do doing a lot of voiceover. Overs. I did voiceover this morning. Yeah. I did voiceover yesterday, mm -hmm. and I did voiceover two days last week. And I'm able to work it into my schedule because my schedule is flexible, and it, it, I can incorporate other things. So it's good. I'm doing a little bit of both. Why did you choose your? Why did you go blonde again? Well, I was originally blonde, and I know, but it just matches my skin better. I think. Red looks great too, though. Thank you. It looks good, Thank but you know you. she's easing back blonde. into it. I, yeah. mean, I, I feel good. better as a blonde, and I feel more 
I don't know. For I'm more com- I'm just much more comfortable with it. But you're a natural blonde. Well, I was born blonde, but as you get older, oh, you it gets darker. So it was oh, a dirty course. dishwater blonde. Yeah, so is you what were it really born is. blonde. So I mean, I help it out a little. Yeah. Right. yeah. You pulled the red off really well, though. The red was Thank very you. sexy. Yeah, super but but sexy. but I I'm partial to the blonde. I like right? the blonde though. I'm liking the blonde now. I'm really happy. <laughs> I mean, it looks great. Yeah. Any old way, really. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. You guys dance together. Oh, uh, what? Is that true? No, no, no. We've no. had a couple of times. Tango? Well, he's technically not one he's of not my dancers. Tango. Yeah, no, I'm okay, not. So he's not. He's not a. Not uh, official. He doesn't do ballroom like oh, okay. I do. Oh, okay. Yeah. So he's yeah. not one of your dancer guys, but he he is one of but your. But he can kind of rug. He's like one of your ring wingman type guys. What? How does he? What's? How does he function? In, in a way, life? he can be my wingman. You know. How does he function in your he's life? He's actually. He feels like family. He's like, he's, uh, like, family, he's, yeah. like yeah. he's like a best friend. And you guys he have feels like a brother. Before, he feels like a did confidant. You guys, did he's... you guys have sex? Definitely no. not. No, no. Never? I had to think about it. <laughs> no? No. Have you ever kissed? We, I mean, we... <laughs> <laughs> we had to kiss. No, we, 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 had, we, had to make, we had to make out on that one scene. In the we Tom, actually did a modeling job in Las Vegas, and we actually they did make yeah. us kiss on every shoot. Yeah. 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 Once he did it for the first weeks. time. Yeah, then they want every yeah. scene kiss. Yes. Yeah. It's like, no, but on like, cue, on like cue. Real, no, 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 it was just a... Uh, uh, you know, it it wasn't like full no, tongue no, and just no. down your throat. We're just, we're, no, we're just friends. And it, uh, and he has someone. He's, you have a girlfriend. He's taken it. <laughs> you, have, you, you don't sound taken. I know. Um, I know. Honey, uh, he's wearing a ring. He's married. Oh, you're married? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. It's a long story. It's a little complicated. Wait. <laughs> Wait a minute. To a guy? No, to a guy. <laughs> No, so so it's. It, where does your wife live? Um, he lives over in West Hollywood. <laughs> it, it is a guy. Is it? Yes. No. Where is it? Yes. Yeah. Your husband. Yes. Yes. Your partner. You call me partner. I met him in. Uh, you Germany. met him in Germany. He's German. He's an Italian guy that Wait, lived in Germany. When? I uh, when I did the first movie. Yeah. What? He's German. Yeah. Well, he's born and raised in Germany, but, but he's an Italian. Italian. Yeah, and yeah, he's hot. Italian. Dang. He's yeah, hot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Does he look like um? Paul Newman. Would that be funny if he looked like Paul Newman? He's got blue eyes and dark hair. He's extremely tall. He's gorgeous. Taller than you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's, he's like 6'3". Six, 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 four? Six, four, six, I'm 6'4". Six, four. He's, he's a little taller than you. Yeah, yeah. So, I have some, a very serious question. Did you shave your chest or is that natural? Wait. Because I've, <laughs> I've seen pictures of you where it's just... It's just Bear. Oh yeah. Oh well. Once in a while, for a shoot, I would shave it. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, no, you have. You have before oh, shaving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I shaved it before. Because yeah. yeah. I was, I was, because I was like, it looked like it was like it didn't look shaven. It looked like there was nothing there. Like, oh, yeah, it no. looked like it was. Waxed. I mean, you did a really good job. I've got a full waxed. No, I just shaved it. Just t- clean. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But it Hand didn't. Shave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I would assume. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I was like, maybe I should do that. I think you should. I think you should totally do no that. Way. I love. It's a lot of maintenance, I, and then I did stubble. And it stubbles up, and then what? And, and then, you get an ingrown hair. Remember the water polo stubble. guys in high school? They yeah. had this. Did they do Silky that? skin because they shaved all the hair off their body. They were so sexy. That's because they were young for the first day, and then you get stubble. Right. Well, you're supposed to shave every few days then. Um, what have you been up to? Well, I bought some new speakers. See those speakers? I bought some great. See those big giant speakers up there? Oh, yeah, those oh. are nice. Those are midfield nice. monitors. Okay. Guess how much those This is a musician. He's really good. Okay, Guess yeah, how yeah. much those speakers yeah. cost? Um, 4000 each. That's a very good guess. I'm a good guesser. They're like 3400 each. That's why I was on a game show. They're normally 3800 each. They're normally, it's normally eight grand a pair. Wow, you got a deal then. I got them. They, right they, were, they, were, they were from the NAM show and they were only used like, uh, for one week. You know what? The NAM show stands for National Association of Music Merchants. Okay. Imagine wow. 40 football fields of music stores. Wow. And guitars wow. and amps and drums yeah. and musicians and pianos. Every and piano. some of the best musicians from all, around the world well, go there. No, all this, the best musicians all, from all well, over the world. Yeah, yeah, all of them. Yeah. Okay, so all. Yeah, imagine 100,000 musicians all running around. You know who Stanley Jordan is, right? Of course he is. So I walk into guitar a room player. and Stanley Jordan is just playing his guitar. He's, and thinking, no, do you know what he's famous for? I mean, sitting right, right next to Stanley Jordan. Do you know what he's famous for? No. The hammer-on technique that that Van Halen does. Oh. He does the he does the hammer-on technique. He, he, he can do regular, but well, he's also like just ridiculous technique. That's amazing. Yeah. That's amazing. So let's just take a pause. Yeah, Cliff, you told me to shut up, and now well, you're well. No, like, let's just at a loss for words. I'm not a loss loss for words. I'm choosing to pause. Okay. Because I want to say something intelligent. Okay. 
And you asked me an important question. Okay. Do you remember what it was? What have you been up to? Yes, what have I been up to? Yeah. You know, I'm just getting back into, you know, I'm, I'm just kind of getting back into finishing the music I started a while back. Good. Um, recorded guitar here the other day with Ricky Z and he killed it. So I got three songs now with JL and I are finishing. Oh, good. So finish. I, I friended JL on Facebook. Hi, JL. Peace out. Peace, JL. You're looking so good. What's up? Totes my goats. <laughs> He's looking really good. Who here knows what who here knows what this means? I don't know what uh, the, uh, it's I like don't a know. surfer thing. Uh, no, this is <laughs> no, who, who, well, Hank, yeah, well yeah. everyone you know what this means, right? Loser. loser. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what does this mean? Um Guess. You give up? Uh, yeah. Loser in three D. <laughs> <laughs> that's all the fourth that's all the fourth graders are gonna say. I love it. I love it. Do, and do you know why do you know why this is the sign of the devil though? Well, it's really like that. Si isn't no, it? look, six, six, six. Oh my God! So that's the sign of the devil. Uh huh. It's, it's not it's, really loser in three D. It's bad. That is bad. It's really it's scary. That's I'm, badass. I'm scared. And it's I guess he's the horns. That's mm -hmm. scary. Mm -hmm. Okay. And everyone does it. Like even even Oprah does that. Hey, rock and roll. Like they have no idea. People have no idea what they're doing or why. No, they're doing No, I think it, they're doing this like hang loose. No, I've seen Oprah do this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. but Oprah uh, probably didn't mean she to do is that. The mark of the devil. <laughs> She's the mark of the devil. <laughs> no, people don't know what the, these symbols mean. These people don't know what anything means really. I've noticed. Yeah. So I want to talk about something. What people do know about, like the movie. What's it called? Uh, this one um, is called. A Allegra dente or something. Allegra, so it's it, music terms. Yeah, yeah. It's it's a. That's a tempo in Italiano. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mezzo yeah. forte, a dente, allegro, presto. Yeah. So what's it? So it's, it's a tempo thing. It's a, yeah. Well, it's we're, the, the little church is getting involved in a contest to win the money to put the church back together and. Okay, uh, so it's a church movie. Well, it's a family you thing. Know, the first movie was a. Uh, Called the church stays in the village, and I was the American billionaire that came in to buy oh, the church. You, you came in, you're the rich guy. Yeah, yeah. And so I came in to buy the church, but then they stole it back from me, and so I fell in love, and da, 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 you know. So and this is the next chapter where the church they moved it in the middle of the night while I was taking it. You know, I was buying it. You're buying the house and, and the, and the, church. the you know bringing it home to America for my mom, and it started to fall wait, apart. You, wait, uh, you you were gonna buy the church and then disassemble it and, and, and put it on a ship yeah, and bring yeah, it home? Yeah. yeah. Well, there was a mom. hidden treasure in the altar, which we. Did didn't you know, know or you didn't? I knew about it, but they didn't know. The, the, the sellers did not know that you were buying it. Correct, them. correct. So there's a hidden agenda. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's actually absolutely. a very good movie. Yeah, it's a very cute movie. movie. It really it's, is. It, it really reminds is. me of Philomena a little bit. Do you see Philomena? No, I heard it. Was really I did good, see Philomena, but Philomena is a depressing, sad. It's such a great movie. No, this she, is a comedy. Okay. Well, a comedy. Well, what about Gary? What about that Lou Wellen movie? That I just saw that Lou last night. The other uh, something he was nominated. Oh, he was I, an artist, you know. I heard a, it was really folk good. Singer. Did you like it? Uh, so it was, oh. it was, he was like a Bob Dylan type. Yeah, it's just yeah, really know. depressed, oh. and you know, it was like didn't okay. go anywhere. Yeah, I don't. Two I don't, hours we were like. Thanks you know, for the warning. I'm not going to go see, see that. I don't remember Never. the name. No sorry. way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. No. It's I want to see good. Thor. Like I like those kind of. Oh, I love Thor. Thor. I love Thor. He's awesome. I can't even remember the last movie I saw, but it was one of them up for Academy Award. I, I did it? see quite a few of the Academy Award movies. That what were about Captain Phillips? Did you see that one? I did not. I, seen that one. I saw Phillips. that. That's really good. Was I really want to see Captain Phillips. Yeah, I want to see that. Yeah. He needs your. He needs. To and I want to see plans. Dallas Buyers Club. Who does? I did not see. What's his name? Yeah. Uh, Forrest Gump. Yeah. Tom yeah, Hanks. Yeah. What about him? He really he needs, needs to go. go on he's got. Time. He's gained some weight. What? Oh yeah, he needs to go. He's a well, maybe it's for the character, but oh, it wasn't. I don't it wasn't, think so. It wasn't no, pretty. No, what no. about the guy in Dallas Buyers Club? They, he played an AIDS guy. He lost a lot of weight. He lost yeah. about twenty pounds. No, 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 not no, no, twenty. No. He, lost he lost about sixty pounds. Sixty six. He's he not, got down yeah. to he got he weighs about one eighty. He got down to about like one thirty. So not he 60 didn't lose pounds. sixty pounds. He lost. He lost 50. a lot. He Have you seen? He doesn't look he like himself. He, he looked didn't. really sick. He looked skinny. yeah. It was kind of like when Christian Bale did um, American Psycho. Was it American? Not no 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 no. It was, no. it was it was it was not American Psycho. What am I saying? He did a movie called like The Mechanic. Oh, the right. Mechanic <laughs> Machinist. Very close. And he lost. A ton of weight, and he was down to like a skeleton size. That's so. It was awful. Amazing. Yeah. You're risking your life when you do that. Actually, but not really because it's yeah. well. He didn't look emaciated. He didn't look like he was sick. Christian Bale did too. You did need he? to look online. Oh, yeah. Check him out. Google. Hey, I lost 18 pounds when I did my cleanse, and I looked pretty skinny. 
That 18 pounds would be a lot for you. A lot. I was at a 167. Oh my god. For six that's what that's you, a perfect high school weight. We, we just started. I'm on yeah, my yeah, second yeah. class. Well, high school, my first yeah. time. There's a place in San Diego, which you do or don't know about. Uh, the you. Optimum Health Institute of San Diego. Oh, I've heard of that. I want yeah. to go, actually. I did. And I was like did 205 you? when I went in. And well, then yeah. by the end, because your, your body just keeps shredding it. Yeah. And you know, at the end, I was about down to one sixty-five. In a week? No, 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 no. no, 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 no over no, like no. two months, oh, your body just—I yeah. yeah. lost. No, I lost twelve pounds in a week. But then you but for just five eleven. You mean so your body keeps losing? Continue to go. Hey, well, I changed because my diet too. Good for you. You know, you, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what it's all about. Show you. It's all wheatgrass based. It, oh, is it? Yeah. I don't. Wheatgrass makes me gag. It's kind of like it is. It's not. This, this I like this. I like this a lot better than wheatgrass. Wheatgrass yeah. is so. I get used to wheatgrass. I get used to wheatgrass too. I don't yeah. mind. Wheatgrass. I can do it if I have yeah. to. I want yeah. to show you a picture of this. Cr I want to show you a picture when I was in high school because we were talking about nostalgia pictures. Yeah. This is me when I was seventeen. Let's see, the far left. Where do you think? Yeah, the tallest one. I was one sixty-seven. That's a oh, cool wow. picture. Yeah. That's me and my buddies, Billy Page. Billy McFadden. He, he's hot, Schweitzer. this Billy Page guy. You like Billy Page? He's hot. Yeah. Yeah, he was cool. Oh my God, look at him, he's so sexy. The way he stands. Yeah, he's, he was like... That guy's a hottie. <laughs> yeah, he was in good shape back then. Look at that, not an ounce of fat on that boy. Oh man, he's looking good. You look great too. I, I look the same. You don't... <laughs> 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 that was 38 years ago. Wait, oh my no, gosh. That was, Wait, if I'm 50 and I was 18, I was 32. 32, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. 32 years ago. I can't even imagine Yeah. that much time going by. It almost looks like Eslin, the background. It does. It looks like Eslin, doesn't that it? Was at, that was at Union Village yeah. Jam back in Vermont. Wow, that's that's. Yeah, that's very I totally cool. remember that of graduation. Here, loading the van. That's You're hot there. And that's a Volkswagen van. Look Volkswagen at that. Volkswagen van with my dad. We, we're yeah. loading my, uh, all my yeah, stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, there, here I'm doing my, you know... Uh, risky business guy. <laughs> those? You still wear the white jeans all the time. Those are those are corduroys. <laughs> <laughs> white corduroys. I've got a pair of them. <laughs> with 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 knockoff fake alligator shirt. Was he couldn't even. Was he a real eyes on? Couldn't even afford it. <laughs> was it eyes on or Lacoste? No, it was just it was like. Remember a, the alligator? Would you call it Lacoste yeah, yeah, yeah. or eyes on? Well, back then it was oh, eyes on, and then it Izod. became Lacoste. But, yeah, but yeah. before then, it was called alligator shirt. Well, it was not. I, we called it alligator shirts. Oh, we have an alligator shirt. I remember the the cool thing was to own a cardigan with the with you know the Izod Lacoste whatever you want to call it on it. A cardigan sweater. Cardigan sweater with the I. Well, about yeah. all the girls used to wear like the the um in the eighties they would wear those sweaters the big turtlenecks and then cowl necks big cowl necks and then they'd have like their their necklace going over their dangling. Top of the hand. And they'd be like, oh my god. It's like. That was so uncool. Yeah, but you know what? You're seeing fashion. Fashion recycles. Yeah. yeah. And you know things make it back. And I do not like high waisted pants at all. And now they've made a comeback. High waisted pants. High waisted because pants of her. Women. Because that movie, her. Oh, I didn't. Spike see Jones. Her yet. Did you see that one? Yeah, I didn't see. It. I heard that's really good. I saw it. Now I'm telling you what, it? it was really creative. And really? he had a relationship with an operating system on the computer. Like a Surrey. Oh a yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a yeah. la Surrey character. Was it boring? It was no. no. It was like you started. You started like. And he'd be like hanging out with his friends, and he'd be on the phone. He's like, "Hi, we're going on a picnic with this phone." And it was, <laughs> and it was, and, but no one is like, "Oh, that's cool." Like no one said anything. They just said it wasn't weird. It was kind of like that movie. It was the, the dummy. He had the, the doll. Who had the dummy? That was um, oh uh, Gosling. Ryan Gosling was in a movie, and he carries around this plastic doll, and he treats her like she's a real person. He oh. tucks her in at night, and everything. And the whole neighborhood's going along with it. Oh, it's the same a, concept. Yeah, even this is like a modern version of that. And that yeah. one's called um, I can't remember the name, but that was a hit in the indie world. Yeah. Well, well, Ryan Gosling's such a great actor. Yeah. Oh, yeah. phenomenal. Yeah, it's amazing. Been a long way. He really yeah. has. Yeah, Definitely. he's just got that charisma about yeah. him. He my one of my favorite movies yeah. he's in, which is. The love story movie, which notebook, the, the notebook, the yeah, notebook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. notebook. Wow. He's gotten in shape. Though, I could too. see that movie over oh and over again. God. It's so it's There's so one movie good. And it was phenomenal shape. I was like, wow. Yeah. So you guys are gonna get in phenomenal shape. You got ten days. Yeah. You're doing well, I did it for place. twelve days last time, Cliff. Was it really twelve? I did twelve days. Did you really? I and I think 10. I dropped about ten pounds in twelve days. About yeah. 10 and then I and then I after that I read a book where I was eating a super healthy diet. Kimberly. Kimberly so let's talk. Let's talk about what happened now. How did you get fat again? 
You know, I just have been yo-yoing on the diet. <laughs> and, and this you, is first of all, you're not fat. I just, ah, just trick you. Say. First of all, you are so friggin' attractive and yeah. sexy and hot. You could be 145 and still be fine. Uh, well, I'm not at my happy weight. My happy you're weight just, is 120 and I'm 130 right now. You want to be exceptionally, ridiculously yeah. hot, which is great. But I'm just saying, you sh you could you could yeah. I mean, I still you could eat as many French fries as you want and drink, do whatever you want to do, and and be I'm sort golden. Of, I'm sort of on probation because I'm single. So I have to be at my very, very best in Just order in case to, someone really good comes along, you're in the grocery blow it. store and yeah. he walks by. I don't then, know who he is, but he's he's somewhere out yeah. there, and you know so I don't want to. Really, so look you really, bad. so you really want. A but I mean, personally, I like to look feel good. So it's so you, not so, just so for. Do you want to be married? Do you want to be married? I would love would to, be, like to married? be married. I would love to. What be What if married? someone just mar married you and said, "I'm so ready." When you just move in, I guess, in the house. And well, I mean, I have to be in love. No, you, yeah, all that. But yeah, you yeah, love yeah. and be married and. um just move in and quit your job and you just <laughs> take care of you and you just go shopping and stuff. You know what? I'm not one who doesn't want to work. I have a lot of goals and I still well, love to be what creative. If, what if he says, look, honey, I don't, you know, I want you to hang out, go travel with me. I don't want you well, to Well, I can turn travel into, you know, a hobby, of course, and I can make that my so passion. So you, you can find a part-time job that would work around your schedule if, if you were in that kind of awesome relationship. Absolutely. You know what? Do you I know mean, how it's many about... guys would want to marry? So many guys would want you. Really? Where are they? I haven't met any of them. I live in L.A. Come on, it's a tough room. He had to go all the way to Germany to meet someone. <laughs> why, don't you and I go to, why don't you and I go abroad and find... I'll, I'll be your wing maybe with my wing girl. We'll, oh, we'll, like I can quit this job I have now that I'm I just, just saying, landed. Maybe one day we could save up some money and we could, we could go backpacking or go, traveling through Amsterdam, <laughs> you know, Netherlands, Sweden, find with all the hot... Poland, you know, Ukraine, wherever they are. Yeah. Find some really, and, and have, because the guys over there love American women. Really? Well, then I'd like to go over there because over here they're not very nice to American women. You know why? Women. Because people are so stuck up and s the guys here want all the young hotties and they're, and they're just Well, mean. the thing about it is the guys that want these young hotties have beer bellies and, you know, these guts and I they're know. not even good looking they're and not. they don't take care of themselves. They are. They and just have money. You know what, money. if somebody doesn't look good or smell good, I don't care how much money they have. I don't want to be with somebody who's stinky and fat. I'm yeah. sorry. You like tall, thin guys. And I'm, I feel sorry for the 20-year-olds that pick those guys because they'll marry them, but it will never last. It's a joke. They don't care. They just want their three years and, and then their green card. <laughs> their three years. They want the green card. <laughs> their green card, exactly. They want the green card or they yeah. want to get hopefully knocked up. But well, hey. Yeah, then they lock That's themselves in, I guess. They lock themselves yeah. in. Yeah. They got yeah. an 18-year I mean, insurance. there are a percentage of men who so they're set want, yeah, yeah, yeah. want a woman that's not, not that 20 years old. Because, yeah. I mean, I think, quite frankly, my body is better than some of these 20-year-old girls that have cellulite and look like crap. Oh, that's and, true. And, and my phenomenal. skin looks and pretty good and my hair looks, I mean, I take care of myself. Yeah, so I, mean, I can it ain't compete. going anywhere. I, I'm not saying I'm that number. I'm not that number. Yeah, yeah. But I look at a lot of girls and I'm thinking, oh, it was your phenomenal. I could give her a makeover. You're she could do charts. a lot better. Absolutely. You're a keeper. I am. Plus, so you can cook and you're nice and I you're know. positive and you're not a weirdo. Oh, I'm and a good cook. Yeah, and I you know. take care of yourself and I you, know. you, you can roll My with. My stomach's growling right now. Wait, I'm who so are you angry. talking about? Her. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and she can, you can no, I can cook, no. Gary. No, 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 she's good. No, yeah. I shouldn't yeah, talk about enough. food because your eyes are fasting. I know it's yeah. really your hard. eyes are really bloodshot. Do you know that they're really red? You know, do you need some visine? No, I need some visine. But you know what's really funny is my eyes? eyes have been bloodshot a lot lately. Maybe it's some stuff. In I don't the know air. if it's allergies. Well, there's stuff in the sleep, air. I'm just weird sure. crap in the air. You know, I've been putting a lot of eye drops in because I've been noticing they happen a little bit. I've never seen your eyes red before. What do you think it is? I don't know. I went to the doctor hurt? and the doctor said, oh, it's just some irritation. You're fine. He didn't find anything. How long anything. has it been? I went to the doctor about a month ago. Mm. Are they red bad as one? No, but they just look, they look they like, look they look too much wine last night. I didn't is that what drink it is? last did night. Did you drink? No, I didn't. Are you drinking? No. Well, I mean. Have you been drinking? Yeah, I've, I've had so, a couple glasses of so wine what, last so how, week. So how did you gain Actually, your weight? Actually, you know what? I didn't have any, any alcohol pounds. this week. Last week, I think I had a glass of wine. So what is it? That, that, what got you there with the 10 pounds? You, you, you get bad on the weekends? Is that what I get is? bad on the weekends. You, you I go out with Carolyn and, but and she's not Michael. Bad. She's skinny, skinny, skinny. I know, because she does very well during the rest of the week. 
I don't know. I thought, I, you, I well, have, I thought you did well on Well, I do, but I have a couple cheats here and there. Like, I had what potato chips the other night. Like a little bag or a whole bag? Half a bag. Half a big bag. Half a big six ounce, eight ounce bag? Yeah, she doesn't. However many ounces What's this pret- bag is, oh, I had half of it. A big bag or a medium sized bag? A full on Dorito sized bag? Well, it was the kettle salt and pepper chips. And not only that, I oh. bought one of those nice breads. And the the, bread I forgot what the heritage, whatever. And then I bought some mozzarella. And then oh, I bought that. some bruschetta. And I mixed the mozzarella. Cheese and bread and I know. Chips. And then I had some Italian uh, chicken Sicilian sausage. Okay, we got to stop talking about this. Yeah. Getting hungry here. I know. <laughs> I know. And I, I mean, I made all this food the other night. And it was, you know. And I thought, well, I'm going on the fast soon. I better finish this. I okay, want, well, I don't want it to go to waste. It sounds to me like you're doing a little micro binging. I'm doing micro binging, I guess. Yeah. So is there a way to not micro binge? How could you? How could you? Um... You know, if I had a really great man in my life, I would see, never do that. See, that's. It's just I do it. We have it on tape right now. Yeah, that's what she's saying. <laughs> Seriously. That's what she's saying. I just if I'm at home alone watching TV, I you know sometimes I watch TV. So now it's an oral I... fixation, and you're stuffing your feelings <laughs> with this food. <laughs> Right? No, it's not that. What I'm is not it, stuffing then? my feelings. I just, in, I you really enjoy, should, I you love just... food. You know how smokers say, you know, I just love well, cigarettes. I like candy. You know, I like, I don't, like candy. Don't, don't edit that out of context because I don't want anybody to think I smoke because I do not smoke. No, but, I, you know, I just love well, cigarettes. I like, Here's what else I like. I like candy. I like chocolate. I don't like that. I like yeah. ice cream. I like fat. I like Kentucky Fried Chicken. Oh, I've I been like, that in years. I like, you know, extra crispy. <laughs> I like potatoes. I like a lot of onion rings. French ah. fries. French fries is my weakness. Sweet potato fries. Yeah. McDonald's potato french fries. fries with extra ketchup. Just uh. in and out burger. Oh, if you're going to do french fries, don't do McDonald's. What's better? Yeah, yeah. You know who has great Mastro's. french fries? Yes. They I, have. I finally went to Mastro's. Really? I Did you finally go there? I went. I go there all the time. I, I love went, that place. Girl, That's my problem, too. An occasional binge at They have Mastro's. a great, like, a yeah. Beatles cover band in there. They're, they're really fun. What night? I don't know. It was Saturday night, I believe. Really? And they were killing it. I was like, they they were rocking it. Wow. It was packed. All the big celebs were there. Why didn't you tell me? Call me. Text me. Hello. I was with a a model and this photographer chick. Her name is. I'm a model. Deanna. And she's (laughs) she's half Iraqi and half Irish. Well, you know what, Cliff? That's the more awesome. the merrier. You don't have to just have one girlfriend. You can I don't have, have a friends. Girlfriend. Right. No, I, I, my friend. I wanted to go to Baked Potato. Baked Potato. I don't potato. have a girlfriend. Baked she doesn't have a boyfriend. <laughs> if, you, if anyone out there, boom, 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 is looking for a girl, she's single. <laughs> she can cook. She smells good. She doesn't complain. She's fun to travel with. Diane, he knows she's that. She's like, cool. You know, we went. Tell them about the trip. Well... Cliff invited this lovely lady to go to Esalen, and she canceled at the last minute. And so Cliff called three or four women. I this think I was number job. four. I was Fail. number four on the list, but no. I was the first one to say yes. Were you number four? We had plans. That I weekend asked you. I said, too. "Was I the first one you invited as the uh, alternate?" And he said, "No, I actually called a couple other people first. You were the first one to answer, though. I, I, Why I, you, I just was in a panic the next day. What am I gonna do? I called every single girl that I thought would be yeah, fun. Yeah, well, yeah, he had this whole retreat set up. Lisa, all for I called everything. Lisa. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah, said, yeah. of course. And she was like. Girl, go. How fast do I have to pack? Come on, I'm she ready. Was, and she was so cool. And she was just like, got it together. Time of your life. We had the we best time. We had a blast yeah, you know, driving they have these and singing and laughing. Jacuzzis over the cliffs. Outdoor. Over the, oh, it's all naked. Big yeah. Big yeah. Oh, no, I've been there before. Clothing Everybody's optional. Naked there. And no one's weird. There's no one's no, like No, he didn't tell you. me it was clothing optional, though. And I get to have with my bathing suit. And Cliff goes, they're going to think you're weird if yeah, you put that on. Yeah, you're not going to need that. And I went. For one second, you So I went, you know what? When in Roman? Boom. Live with the Roman. Yeah. And yeah. you know what? No one said anything. No one cared. She's got a great naked body. I was like in heaven. Mm-hmm. We didn't have sex. We didn't even I, kiss. You know what? This this. I wanted this... to though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I wanted to. Okay, so um, I want to thank my two guests, Gary Smith. Thank you. Thank you, Cliff. And my co-host, my lovely co-host, the new blonde, Avis Rentmore, who I'm just in love with. And I would marry her right now if she would say yes. I would. I really would. <laughs> but she doesn't want to be. I didn't say that. You're not saying yes. <laughs> but I love her as a friend. I love her. I love her as a friend. has too many girlfriends. So? He doesn't make... He, he would get so bored of me so quickly. What if What if I just decided to marry you right now on the spot on camera and said, Avis, will you marry me? <laughs> right now. Would you? Would, please? Yes. Okay. <laughs>
<laughs> High five. <laughs> we got it on camera. Oh, that's what a great way out. I, I love you. I love you. I love you. I lips are gone. Would you have married him? I love this guy. Yeah. Maybe. You, she might have. I might have. Yeah. We have a lot of fun together. Yeah. Why, why can't you just be with friends and not be married? How, what's wrong with that? That's what I'm doing right now, and I love my life. So I if, have no complaints. What if you never get married and you just hang If I out? never get married, it'll be okay. If I never get married, it'll be fine. It'll be fine, yeah. It'll okay, fine. so I want to thank my guests. Thank you. Uh, thank you. You guys are awesome. Thank and you. he's got a new movie coming out in Germany. In Germany, yeah. <clears throat> He's a big star in Germany. He is a big celebrity in screw, Germany, though. Screw yeah. David Hasselhoff. This is the new guy. <laughs> yeah. This is yeah. the one. And he looks uh, good on the red carpet in yeah. his tux. Yeah, uh, Gary Smith, uh, ladies and gentlemen. And you, are you allowed to say what the name of the movie is? Uh, yeah. Is it in, is it in negotiation? You said it earlier. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's called Adante Adagio. Adagio Adante. Adante. Uh, Allegra Adante. Allegra oh. Viagra Adante. <laughs> Viagra it may change, but yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's called Viagra Cialis meets a Dante in Vegas. There you go. Okay, so <laughs> I'll be my two lovely guests. Thank you, be good. We'll see you next week. <laughs>